as random as it sounds, and it, it it's kind of funny. It is kind of random in a way yeah. because I, I I joke in saying that a lot of the big events in my life kind of happened serendipitously. Yeah. Um, how I actually got into it at all was I actually was sitting next to a guy on an airplane as we were flying to Mexico City or actually Guanajuato, Mexico for a wedding. And it turns out he was attending the same wedding I was going to, didn't know him. So go. we just started you, talking so you about shooting, what you, yeah, you were shooting it, right? Right, right. I but, was actually a guest. I was a guest. Oh, you're just a time. guest. You weren't even shooting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was not shooting. I was just, you know, chatting. I talked to everybody. Okay. So some people joke, it's like, you never met a stranger, have you, Trung? I'm like, nope. I just, I, I'm very curious. I talked yeah. to everybody and he said, yeah, I'm a professor at University of Houston and yeah. I actually am about to start my first Smoothie King store. I'm like, that is so fascinating. I go to Smoothie King like three times a week. Yeah. Awesome, oh, right? Yeah, so okay. I, so you're a regular consumer. Customer. Yeah, I was a consumer. I love the product. And so I was like, you know, I can, this is somebody I need to stay in touch with. And every quarter we'd go meet for lunch, just kind of check in how he's doing. And it wasn't with any agenda. It was somebody interesting. I wanted to kind of keep in touch with basically. And, um, you know, I started telling him, I was like, you know, I'm really thinking about potentially opening my own store. And so we talked some more. And then a couple months after that, he's like, hey, my mom and I both own my first store. Would you be interested in buying her out and being 50-50 partners in the business? I was like, I looked at the numbers. I was like, let's do it. 